that. Thanks. In terms of social distancing goes, I think this is the most spread out you can be in any sport. So I think And just so. keep that social distancing. It's yeah. only like two club lengths <laughs> away here, you know? <laughs> Golf is back in Illinois, at some courses at least. For the weekends, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, our, we are at absolute max capacity from 6.30 a.m. to 6.30 p.m. The Glen Club in Glenview, about 15 miles northwest of Chicago, is one of several golf courses reopening May 1st under specific guidelines per Illinois' COVID-19 stay-at-home order. Biggest changes is going from foursomes, you know, traditional four players in a group, to two players only. Our tee time intervals here used to be uh, 10 minutes and are normally 10 minutes apart here. They've now had to been changed to 15 minutes. Spacing out smaller groups deters human contact. Illinois' rules for reopening golf courses range from closing all pro shops and clubhouses to no handshakes. I've talked to several golfers out here after the round and you know they feel like this is a safe space. They can come, get out, get some fresh air, not come within six feet of staff or their playing partner. One big adjustment Illinois golfers are making this month is not using these. All golfers must travel by foot to maintain social distancing. I think it's better than nothing, so I'll take it. We agree with the rules. I would rather have a cart, play my music, and have a cocktail. The Chicago Park District is keeping its golf courses closed for the month of May. So Chicagoans like Danny Steinberg are leaving the city limits to play around. I'm glad I have a dad who belongs to a uh, suburban club. I think at this point I'm going to hit a pitching wedge over the tree onto the green. Golfing at the 18-hole course in Glenview can get pretty pricey. Seven miles southeast of here is Skokie Park District's Weber Park Golf Course, a much smaller yet affordable course that also opened May 1st. Our nine-hole par three golf course was built in 1974. Been a lot of heavy traffic the last few days, and we expect that's going to continue at least for the next couple of weeks. Lifelong golfer Candy Spreckman couldn't wait to hit the green. Oh, I've always loved golf. The next shot is going to be the best shot in the world. And the sound of the ball hitting the cup, you know, it's just, it's continuously rewarding. For Chicago Tonight, I'm Evan Garcia.